I always wonder what it would be like to put up a video that has footage put in reverse. And now I'm about to share that video with the world. Okay, not having it with some Modern Warfare 3 gameplay. This is uh, Spec Ops Survival Mode. Two screens, two players playing. On uh, resistance, backwards. I start off by dying. Who does that, right? Look up in the top right corner. You got uh, the Game Caviar watermark. If you are a YouTuber, okay, and you're looking to be different, and you're looking to stand out, you can't just stand out by having Modern Warfare 3 videos. Everybody does that. Everybody does COD. COD has been around the block. COD is loose. Everybody does COD. I do COD. What you gotta do is what I've done. I've given my channel a name, an identity. I gave my channel a, 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 a logo to go along with that name. I made that logo into a watermark. I put that watermark on my videos. I took that logo and I put it on t-shirts. I made those t-shirts. And I put them on. I designed them and I put them up for sale. You can have one. I'll put the link in the description. A lot of people talk about you got to be different. You got to stand out. This is how you stand out. Bring up a name. Get a logo. Nobody wants to. to if everybody was on COD and everybody had like three KD ratios and everybody was going, you, you know, um, like 60 and two in every match, how would you be able to tell people apart? How would you be able to tell people apart? But see, with my channel, from day one, I don't care whether I go 24 and four, four and 24, one and 17, I don't care. The gameplay is secondary to my, to my commentary. And I think I've come a long way. I've stepped up my game from the Roxio to the HD PVR. I went from uh, a no-name software to Sony Vegas 10. Sony Vegas 10 wasn't good enough. I went to Sony Vegas 11. I started. I, I started doing vlogs. I started. You know. Um. I, I put my own watermark on my own videos. I'm not saying I'm not gonna use watermarks from other uh, websites I'm still gonna use the Yoush watermark I still may use the Huppet watermark but for the majority of my videos you will see this game caviar watermark plastered in that upper right hand corner unless I forget which I probably won't it's all about standing out it's all about being different when I sit up here and I say this game caviar movement is gaining steam and you need to get on it because it's crazy and it's going to take over. I mean, every syllable of every word that I say, I have people that have bought the t-shirts and have told me about it. I have a backing. I have good subscribers that comment. And when I say like, comment, subscribe, spread the word, I mean it because I want as many as many people in the world to see these videos and understand Game Caviar and understand that we're not going anywhere and understand that we're taking over. I want as many people to see that as possible. They will see these videos and they will understand. They will say this guy's for real. He has a good product. I want to get with this movement. And I don't blame him. Because if I saw my videos, I would subscribe and I would tell everybody about it because this is crazy. I am for my subscribers. I'm here for you because you are the people that ultimately make all of this worthwhile. I like making videos. I like posting them. I like interacting with people and, and, and you know, gaining uh, a name for myself in this gaming community, but ultimately the subscribers, the people who actually take time to look at my videos and comment on them and press like, the people that I, I talk to online and, and, and talk to through PSN and play online with, those are the people that really make this worthwhile. And when I say I really appreciate everything you do and all of your, all of your, uh, all of your support, I mean it because I do, I do appreciate it. And I've gotten a lot of good feedback from my channel. 
And I think my channel deserves way more attention than it's getting. I'm not saying that to be cocky. That's truthful. I make good videos, and I've seen a lot of people's videos, and I'm like, how are they getting these many subscribers? And they make garbage videos that have, you know, no lasting appeal. And I'm not saying all of my videos are good and, you know, will, will stick with you. But I'm saying, generally, I put out way better material than a lot of other commentators. I made it so I stand out for a reason. The only way to get attention is to stand out. And that's what I'm doing. But anyway, Modern Warfare 3. Um, on PlayStation 3, I was looking at my stats the other day. I got my KD over one. Not a big deal. Not playing for KD. But I do a better job on PS3 than Xbox 360. I'm not too sure why. But that's I, I think it's because I started on Xbox first. I put more hours in the Xbox than PS3. By the time I got the game for PS3, I knew the maps. I knew the guns. I knew where the, where the campers were at. I wrecked their campsite. That's what I did. So that's probably what it is. But still, I feel more comfortable playing on PlayStation than Xbox. But I'm still going to play them both. If you want to play with me, uh, hit me up. My uh, gamer tag is not having it. My PSN username is not having it with a lowercase n. I don't know whether that makes a difference, but still. It's, it's, the, it's the same on either console. Uh, they released Modern Warfare 3 on Wii, but since I don't have a Wii, I'm not going to... I don't play it. And even if I did, I wouldn't play, I wouldn't buy... Uh, uh -uh. I've seen videos of Black Ops on Wii, and it looks like a joke. Why would they even release that game on a Wii? Wii is garbage to begin with. I had a Wii, and to be honest, it was fun. And Nintendo could have really done something with that console but they screwed it up so now you stuck with this Wii that's being phased out because they already have announced their next console good job Nintendo so yeah feel free to add me on PSN and Xbox 360 um, if I'm on and I'm playing hit me up with an invite you know I'll, I'll roll through, you know, if I don't stay on for a long time, please don't hold that against me. I just, I, I'm the type of dude that I play and I, you know, I get whatever I need to get in, you know, my fix and then I get off. But yeah, if you, if you see me online, please, by all means, hit me up. I mean, I'm not going to ignore you. I want to be that guy that always has time for his subscribers. I will always pay attention to you because you guys are the ultimate supporters. And I appreciate it. So I do better on PS3. I feel more comfortable with PS3. I'm starting to like this game a lot more. Um, somebody hit me up on one of my other videos and said that uh, Infinity Ward was supposed to be fixing the lag compensation. Um, that they didn't have a timeline. I hope it's soon. But um, if it happens, it happens. If not, then I have became um uh, i have become used to it and i've figured out ways to overcome it some people have said that if you do um what is it uh port forwarding through your router you could google it i'm pretty sure they already have uh you know uh walkthroughs on how to do it and i know they have it in general but I, i'm pretty sure they have it for what ports need to be forwarded for um modern warfare 3 to help you out i haven't tried that yet i don't know whether i can i have a, Air, a apple uh, airport extreme so i may or may not be able to do port forward and i probably will i just have to dig into it and i'm being lazy so you know um but yeah even without that like i was playing yesterday actually you know what i didn't play online on ps3 i played on did i play xbox i didn't play on xbox but yeah the, the past couple days when i played it's been better um I haven't felt like I've been screwed over as much as I as I did, uh, but but still, it needs to be worked on. I'm telling everybody, everybody that sees this video, make your voice heard to Infinity Ward. Let them know that what they've done is not acceptable. You want to put out a BS game that we have to pay sixty dollars for? 
and you gave us this and then you you're gonna take your time to fix it it's unacceptable do not let infinity war do that to you i'm not letting them do that to me i'm giving them a timeline I will give them upwards of, I'll be, I'm feeling generous because it's the holiday season. I will give you exactly one week, seven days from today to fix this problem. If you don't, then I'm, I'm, I'm abandoning, I'm boycotting Modern Warfare 3, Modern Warfare 2, Modern Warfare, which is my favorite card. Anything that has Infinity Ward's name on it, I'm boycotting and I'm going back to Black Ops until this is fixed. Infinity Ward, this is unacceptable. You gave us a piece of trash and you knew it. Battlefield 3 has dedicated servers. You sell way more than Battlefield 3. I find it unbelievable that you do not have enough money for dedicated servers. I don't buy it. Make it happen. I mean, I, 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 don't, I don't like to be like this. I like to be the guy that comes through. And I, I don't know. I'm really amped up for some reason today. And I don't know why. But I, I, I'm feeling this. I'm really feeling this. I fixed the game, Infinity Ward. I had no problem going back to Black Ops. I don't care. I'm starting to like Black Ops a lot better than everybody's playing uh, Modern Warfare 3 now anyway. So, I mean, I could go back to Black Ops. I don't care. But I'm telling everybody that sees this video, do not let Infinity Ward push you around. Do not let that company push you around. You paying your own money for a game that you expected to work just as better, just as good as the $60 that you paid for it. So make them, make it known that you are pissed off about it and that you're not going to stand for it. Let Infinity Ward know that. Otherwise, they're just going to keep doing it. They just gonna keep doing it. Modern Warfare 4. They just gonna keep doing it. I guarantee you. It's like a dog. If you don't check a dog that's always peeing in the house, he's gonna keep peeing in the house. Let him know what time it is. This video is just about done. Thank you for all the support. I really appreciate it. I still. I, my goal of 100 subscribers by the end of the year is within my reach and I'm steadily gaining subscribers every day and I love it. If you're a subscriber and you see this video, comment on it, like it, spread the word. I'm not having it.